morning it is summer again here in alaska in fairbanks um i'm so happy i have my cup of coffee uh here on the deck and i'm watching the squirrels i went already on a dog walk um yeah i've been uh, active this morning and craig just got some water because craig is getting ready to leave tonight what did you put in your coffee because we are out of milk? Uh, I put that pudding. <laughs> that was not pudding. What is it? Yogurt cream with a mango taste. With mango taste. <laughs> well, <laughs> we have the new Starbucks hit right here. I'm going to try it out. <laughs> and it's a little, little tangy. Like, tastes like a little orange juice got splashed in there. I headed home and the midnight sun was as beautiful as always. Emma entertained me as I ate my dessert. everybody made it to my mother's house here in Birmingham Alabama so let's go and let you guys meet my mother everybody meet my mother How you doing? Now, this is my mother everybody right here we're down so here in Birmingham happy to have you with me we have to see you so we're gonna uh, brush you up on some more uh, times here in Birmingham as right now let's say hello here in Alaska, the mornings were as slow as usual. I always appreciate it if one of our children can share one of the meals with us when their schedules and other obligations allow. This shared time provides time to connect. Well, we're down here in Alabama and going here to a nail shop where my mother visits quite frequently. It's called, uh, let's see, A&T Nails. Well, I'm not getting my nails, maybe my toenails they're probably in bad shape staying in boots all year round almost in Alaska so let's uh go ahead and get these things squared away yeah this is my mother and Tony here uh, how many how many years you in Alaska 14 14 years. My nails, pedicures, and manicures for many well, years. This is the now. first time I've ever done anything like this, so we'll uh, let you guys know how this is all going to turn out. I think Tony's been taking care of my mother's feet and toes for, for years now, so it should be pretty good. Thank you so much, Ronald. <laughs> <laughs>
break is gone and I am going to do something completely new, something I've never done before. I'm gonna make pizza and use our grill, his baby. Let's see if it works. ample time for myself. For me alone time is essential. In the presence of others we can feel the pressure of expectations. Especially as women we need to be careful not to lose sight of our beliefs, goals and dreams. Spending time with oneself is an excellent opportunity for self-reflection. It allows time to grow in line with one's values, helps to balance our emotions and benefits our well-being and relationships. Everything is just easy Since you told me what could become of me I put together all the pieces And now it's time I just spoke with Greg. His weather looks a little bit different than ours. It's not really cold up here. It's just super windy. It's also pretty cloudy. Like I said, it's not super cold. It's just not super warm either. In Norway is super slow this morning. I don't know what's going on with her today. Potted some herbs in uh, pots. They're gonna stay here at the greenhouse in front of the greenhouse at the sitting area in front. Oh, mosquitoes are here. And organize the greenhouse because this is always a big mess. And in the garden, I um, still have some kale plants and salad plants I need to plant. I will do that tomorrow. I think it's enough for today. I still have to make dinner. That's one part I miss right now. Dinner is not taken care of by Craig because he's gone. So I will need to do that. And that's 
okay i can handle it i'm just a little bit tired from gardening <laughs> If you're ever in Birmingham, Alabama on the weekend, this is the place to be. It's called Pepper's Place. It's a farmer's market. I mean, it's really exciting to see all kind of people here enjoying themselves. A lot of stuff for sale. So come down and check it out if you're ever in Birmingham on a Saturday. water wagon and it's time to get some water i haven't done this for i don't know one two three years and uh, let's see if i can still do it Folks carry all these things in their purses down here back Everything, home. anything you want, you can even have a <laughs> And every visit comes to an end. So we are on the way to the airport. I'm sitting in the back. Kids sit sit in the front and one of them is driving total different perspective but it's gonna be fine and we will see you next time take care of yourself and your loved ones sending love and peace from alaska and thanks for watching and all of your support don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.